dividing fractions by whole numbers. Now, before I start this, I want to tell you a little bit about a pig. Let's say you have a pot belly pig. Pigs all have a good sense of direction and a good memory. If you took your pig on a walk for all oh, 15, 20, 30 minutes, and then hid from your pig, your pig would find his or her way home because pigs have a good sense of direction and a good memory. Now, I want you to use your good memory after I teach you this so that you can solve problems. Let's say you had a pound of chocolate, but then you ate five-eighths of that chocolate. Who's the piggy? Anyway, you have three-eighths of a pound left, and you want to divide it among three of your friends and yourself, so among four people. So, you divide each eighth into fours. Now, if you had the original pound, you would have 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8 times 4, or 32 pieces, little pieces. And each friend would get one quarter of what you actually have left, one quarter of the 3 eighths. So we're going to take this, this is one of your friends will get one quarter of this part and one quarter of this. So that will be three thirty seconds of a pound for each friend. Now to prove that you did this correctly, we're going to multiply three thirty seconds by four and see if we get three a's. We're undoing the division by multiplying. We could put 4 over 1. 4 times 3 is what? 12 over 32. But I thought we had 3 eighths. You can reduce the fraction by dividing the numerator and the denominator by the same common factor, 4. Twelve divided by four is three. Thirty-two divided by four is eight. And you prove that by getting the original amount of chocolate that you divided among four friends.